Good morning, sweeties. You are as sweet as the morning dew drops on the honeysuckle flower. Okay, my dears. There is a popular saying: "Good habits start earlier." So, like education, we need to give more importance of good habits as well. So, healthy habits need to be started earlier. So now I am going to show you a moral video how you need to improve yourself. Yes, okay. This is going to be the enrichment activity before your class. Look at the video and enjoy yourself. <laughs> Tofu, don't talk with your mouth full. It's okay, Jaya. It's just you and me. I think the only way to get you eat quietly is to tell you a story. Hmm. Yes. Yes, Jaya. Bad habits. Once upon a time, a rich businessman lived with his eight-year-old boy. Just as his wife had said, the businessman loved his son, but hated that he had some bad habits. Worried about his son's behavior, the man went to a wise master. Oh, wise master! My son is a very good boy, but he has picked some unhealthy habits which I cannot get him to let go. I worry about him all the time. Please help me. Bring him to me tomorrow morning. The next morning, the man did as the master had said. He brought his boy to him. Come, son. Let's go for a walk. The boy obeyed, and they went for a walk in the garden. As they walked, they came upon a little sapling. Son, pull out the sapling for me. The boy did that easily and presented the master with the sapling. Very well. Now you see that small plant. Pull that out for me. The boy did as asked and easily pulled the plant out. Next, the master asked him to pull out a bush. It took some effort, but the boy did that too. Now see that small tree, son. Pull that out for me. The boy went to the small tree, and though it took him a lot of effort and struggle, he pulled it out for the master. Very well done. Finally, look at that big tree over there. Pull that out too for me. The boy tried and tried, but the tree did not budge. Finally, tired, the boy gave up. I am sorry, wise master. I cannot pull that tree out. It is old and strong. Bad habits are just like the plants and trees. When they are new, like the sapling, you can get rid of them quickly and easily. But if you let them stay and grow, they grow strong and become like the old tree that cannot be removed. Forgive me, master. 
I now understand what my father has been trying to tell me. I will drop all my bad habits from now on. Dear, what if talking with food in my mouth becomes my bad habit too? I will stop it right now. I will never talk with food in my mouth ever again. That's great. Thank you, Tofu. Okay, my dears. I hope you all learned something from the video. Yes, let we get inside to our concept that is large numbers. Yes, today we are going to learn about Roman numerals. We know already of writing numbers. It can be two ways. One is Hindu Arabic number. That is a usual way what we are writing as one, two, three. The another one is called as Roman numeral. Okay. So in this video, we are going to learn about Roman numerals. Okay. Let me start the class. Let us quickly look at the seven basic Roman numerals. I stands for one. V stands for five. X stands for 10, L stands for 50, C stands for 100, D stands for 500, M stands for 1000. Now, a trick to remember the Roman numeral. Now, I written the symbols I, V, X, L, C, D, M. I value x-rays. Let's count the doctor's money. Students, these two statements will help you to remember the Roman numerals in the correct order. Not only this, you can use your own statement for keeping this in a correct order. Let me see the rules. There are three rules. Rule of repetition, rule of addition, rule of subtraction. Rule of repetition. Symbol I, X, C and M can be repeated three times at maximum. Roman numerals, look at x10, xx20, xxx is 30, but 4x will not possible. So, we couldn't able to write 4x. So, we can repeat the symbol three times. Symbol V, L and D are never repeated. Look at the example, x is 10. But we couldn't able to write V, V. Now, rule of addition. If a symbol of smaller value is written to the right of a symbol of higher value, we add smaller value to the greater value. Look at the example. X, I. I in the right side of a greater value 10. So, we can able to add the two numbers 10 plus 1 is equal to 11. The next one, rule of subtraction. If a symbol of smaller value is written to the left of a symbol of higher value, we subtract the smaller value from the greater value. Look at the example i x i is smaller value which is left on the symbol of greater value here the greater value is x so we will subtract the value of x and i that is 10 minus 1 which is 9 now i have given a small depiction which will help you to understand the addition and subtraction rule. This gentleman is Roman numeral X. This is the left and this is the right. 
whatever comes to his left we will subtract whatever comes is right we will add now the young boy has the value i now the roman numeral formed is 1x the young boy comes stand left of him so we subtract 1 from 10 10 minus 1 is equal to 9 so the roman numeral becomes i x which is 9 now the boy comes and stand his right young boy's value is i 1 so the roman numeral found is x i i is on his right so we will add the value of i to the value of 10 so x i becomes 10 plus 1 11 now some of you could ask me we would also rewrite as x is standing on the left of i x is on left of then we subtract 1 minus 10 as minus 9 this is wrong when we start reading the roman numeral need to start with a roman numeral which has the greatest value in this case x has the greater value so now we will look at what is on his left and right that's why we do not take x1 as 1 minus 10 that is 10 plus 1 which is 11 now the next rule rule of subtraction i x and c are used to subtract the symbol v l and d cannot be subtracted from any number let us take an example 45 now 45 you cannot write it as 50 minus 5 that is incorrect we will write 45 as 40 plus 5 40 in term will be written as 50 minus 10 so we can able to write xl that is x is 10 and l is 50 subtraction rule now x l v as 45 now we will write roman numeral 1 to 50 in order you already know 1 is 1 v as 5 x as 10 we will write the in between roman numerals by using the rules we will use the rule of repetition to write 2 that is i i for 3 that is i i i we couldn't use the symbol more than thrice so we couldn't write i i i so we can write 5 minus 1 as 4 so i on the left of 5 which is i v now 6 5 plus 1 which is v i i is on right of v so we will add the value then v i i 8 v i i i 9 we couldn't use 3 i so we are subtracting 10 minus 1 that is i x the smaller value is left side to the greater value so 9 is equal to i x 10 x now have a good look at these roman numeral 1 to 10 they form a basic for the further content for 4 and 9 we used the subtraction rule i just written 1 to 10 on one corner now we can build up the numbers 11 to 20 now 10 is x so 10 plus 1 is 11 so 11 can be written as x 1 11 now 12 10 plus 2 x 1 i i 13 x i i i 14 10 plus 
so x i v 15 x v 16 x v i 17 x v i i 18 x v i i i 19 x i x and 20 we are using 2 x x x now basically what we have done we have put x in front of all the numbers from 1 to 10 and we built 11 to 20 now look at we are going to concentrate 20 to 30 so x x is 20 we have put xx in front of all numbers from 1 to 10 and generate 21 to 30. 21 xx1, 22 xxii, 23 xxiii, 24 xxiv, 25 xxv, 26 x x v i 27 x x v i i 28 x x v i i i 29 x x i x 30 it's triple x in the same way we are going to generate 31 to 40 by using 30 x x x now 31 x x x plus 1 that is x x x i 32 x x x i i so we are writing x x x as 30 1 1 as 2 now 33 x x x i i i 34 x x x i v 35 x x x v 36 x x x v i 37 x x x v i i 38 x x x v i i i 39 x x x i x now 40 4 x together but in roman numeral we couldn't write any symbol more than thrice so 40 as 50 minus 10 that is x l the smaller value which is the left of the greater value so for 40 we can able to write x l now for 41 to 49 we have to write xl in front 41 40 plus 1 so xl 1 42 is 40 plus 2 xl i i 43 40 plus 3 so x L I I I 44 is X L I V 45 X L V 46 X L V I 47 X L V I I 48 X L V I I I 49 x l i x 50 we know already l is 50 we return x l in front of 1 to 10 to generate 41 to 49 okay my dears i hope you all understood how to write the roman numerals thank you so much have a nice day ahead